Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario 64 with me, Oxfu. And last time, well, we started the LP and we had a surprise guest in the form of OX Girl Fu. And we did some other crap, so... You know what? First of all, before we get going anything else, um... Yeah, I, I was talking. I was talking to Rock Paper Mario about this a little earlier. How I, I just absolutely love how Super Mario 64 is one of those games where it's just there's so much room and so much they put into it, and everything about it is not linear. Like even the very first level, you can do this. And there we go. You chomp, you stomp on chomp, <laughs> stomp on chain chomps, whatever host or, or whatever it's called. And there we go. We, we can get the very, well, we can get the sixth star in this world right away. Still, <laughs> it's still crazy getting used to these controls, you know? I completely forgot that I could actually do a backflip. But anyway, yeah. Behind Chain, Ch Chain Chomp's Gate. That's the last... The very last star. Oh. You've now recovered three power stars. Now you can open any door with a three on its star. You can come and go from the open courses as you please. The enemies ahead are even meaner, so be careful. But anyway, yeah, that's the supposedly the hardest star in that level. Well, I say supposedly. It definitely is the hardest. Because... I actually just really went through that star fast. I'm completely amazed. I'm not even done with my intro, for the most part. Reacting to the star power, the door slowly opens. Anyway, after we've got that out of the way, let's just move on to Thwomp's Fortress. Oh my god, I got that in less than like two minutes. Anyway, hello! The Hello, the Lakitu brothers, cutting in with live update on Mario's progress. He's about to learn a technique for sneaking up on enemies. The trick is this, he has to walk very slowly in order to walk quietly. And, yeah, Lakitu brothers signing off. Anyway, here we have Th Thwomp's Fortress. I mean, this is probably one of my favorite levels in this entire game, just because, I don't know, it's got a simple design that is very easy to just fall in love with. <laughs> Nothing more than that, you know? Whoops. Anyway, um... Yeah, no, the, basically what we've got to do in this level... Again, if you've never played it, but I'm assuming most of you have played it, because, I mean, Super Mario 64, you ever had a Nintendo 64? How could you have not had this game? That's crazy! But anyway, yeah, ba basically point of this level is we have to get to the top of the fortress. Whoa! Forgot we could jump on top of those guys. Oh, this was actually one of the um, levels they remade for Super Mario Galaxy 2, isn't it? I have no idea. I never played that game. Anyway. It makes me so mad. We build your houses, your castles, we pave your roads, and still you walk all over us. Do you ever say thank you? No! Well, you're not going to wipe your feet on me. I think I'll crush you just for fun. You have a problem with that? Just try to pound me, Wim. Ha ha! Anyway. Easy, boss. Well. I say easy, boss, and then... Look at me, just failing already. Easy way to take care of them, just run underneath them. Side jump. Bam! You all know that anyway. <laughs> Honestly, we might be able to do the red, eight red coins by jumping off of him, couldn't we? Anyway, no crushed again. I'm just a stepping stone after all. I won't gravel. Er, grovel. Here you win. Take this with you. I wonder about that, actually. If we could actually use him falling over on the side to actually get some of the eight red coins. Probably not, though. It doesn't look like he's tall enough. Maybe, though. Huh. You know what? I'm actually gonna try that out. You know, go for something crazy while we're at it. Because I never thought about that. Go back to Chip Off Womp's block. Thank you very much. Oh, it's so nice to be able to do that again. 
I, I know I was complaining la last episode about how I'm so spoiled now, thanks to Super Mario Sunshine, but it's true! It's true! You can just spin on a dime on that! I'm still so surprised that it's so different, because I always thought that this was, like, the pinnacle of reactivity, reflexive, reflexivity. You know what? We forgot to get the other red coins. If we're gonna be able to do that, we're gonna get in there, you know? You know? You know? Oh, shoot, really? Come on, yeah, there we go. Okay, we got it. Gonna remember to actually get them now. Okay, we don't have to get any down here. We do, however, have one up here on these little guys. We've got one on the Womps, I think they're called. I believe it's on this guy. No, no. Do backflip! Okay, don't do backflip. Wow, that's really weird. Um, anyway, do backflip! Okay, guess not. Must be on the other guy. Wow, that was a waste of my time. There we go. Yep, okay. Ah, no, 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 no. Jeez, Louise. Anyway, there we go. Okay, got what I needed. Got what I came for. Four. Get in five. So how have you guys been going? I know I haven't really been asking the tried and true Let's Players question to fill in those dull moments, but how have you guys been going? I've been absolutely fantastic. Thank you very much for asking, even in even if you didn't. Because you know what? School's been great. Oh my goodness. I mean, those of you that know me and have talked to me, you know that I've changed majors this semester. Those of you that don't know me and haven't talked to me, you probably know I've changed majors anyway, because I've been talking about, a lo about it a lot. And it's just really great, because I really enjoy being an English major much more than I did being a computer science major. Like... I, I don't really know how to explain it. You know? Oh, shoot. Well, there we go. That's one way to lose. Anyway, come on. Okay. Let's try getting you over here. Okay. No, 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 no! Okay, we gotta switch to Mario Cam. See how it is. I see how it is. Yeah, we can definitely get over there by using this guy. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Flip! Okay, we gotta, we gotta, but we gotta use Mario. Oh my goodness, we're gonna be do able to do this. Oh my goodness, we're gonna be able to do this. This is the coolest thing I've ever tried in this game. Oh my goodness, we're getting eight red coins. How cool is that? I know probably some of you are saying, like, that's not really cool, but to me, this is, this is like the pinnacle of cool. Because I never tried to get this when I was a kid. I was just like, oh, you gotta wait until the eight red coins mission. But no, we're getting the eight red coins on the first mission as the second star. How cool is that? Like, we don't even have the wooden bridge to go across. We had to use Thwomp. King Thwomp, whatever his name is, to do that. That right there, that was cool. To me. <laughs> um, yeah, whatever, we'll go somewhere else. Oh, you know what? We might as well do some Jolly Roger Bay, because I gotta get to that anyway. I really just don't like Jolly Roger Bay. Well, I mean, that's just me. I know some people really love it, just because it's a water level. Actually, you know what? Before we go to Jolly Roger Bay, we can go up here! We can go up here! Oh, is this the wrong one? This, this has gotta be the wrong one. Otherwise, we would've gone through it. We can go up here! We can go up here! Whoop! Do another eight red coins mission. Why the hell not? We've got enough time anyway. We got like a few minutes. Besides, I want to get this out of the way. Just really don't like water levels. I can't really tell you why. Because, I mean, well, no. I was explaining why I don't really like water levels a little earlier today. Um, I just don't like having to deal with a clunky system. Like swimming, I, I like I really don't like swimming in any any game. 
Unless it's a game that you spend pretty much all of your time swimming. Um, just because I don't really have the patience to just sit here and press A. 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 Instead, I like to be like, yeah, running along, pressing the control stick. Plus, you have to worry about keeping up a life gauge, especially in games like this. Like, it's not so bad in some other games. Like, Metroid, you have water parts, but you don't have to worry about your life gauge. But in this, you've got your life gauge to worry about, and I don't, I don't want to worry about it, you know? <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's nice aesthetically, but... Especially some of them, like in Super Mario Sunshine, when you have to go to Noki Bay and get the red coins from the fish. I'm just freaking out because I'm afraid I'm going to die all the time. Anyway, enough for ranting for this episode, I guess. So I will see you guys next time on Let's Play Super Mario 64 with Miox Fu. And I'll stop now. Um, so, I'll, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Um... Yeah, no, I'm not doing that. Take it easy, guys. Whoa. Whoa.